I've been in this industry for 30 years. Um, I've been successful. I've enjoyed a wonderful career. It's time to give back. My name is Kent Lorenz. I'm the chairman and CEO of ACETA in Pewaukee, Wisconsin. We are a robotic integration company, it really specializing in the industrial manufacturing sector, but even more specifically in the metal manufacturing sector. We have to take the knowledge, whether it's welding or loading and loading a machine tool or painting or sealing, and transfer that to the robot's control. The robot then does that same thing over and over again, which is terrific, but we still need that skilled technician, that skilled engineer to transfer that knowledge into a very automated process that's repeatable, and really that's the future manufacturing. My name is Matt Gorski, my job title is a robotic technician. I'm a graduate of the Automation Systems Technology program at Waukesha County Technical College. I, I was looking for something that, uh, that challenged me, that I could grow in, um, a position where I needed to continue my training and wasn't a repetitive job and something that I enjoyed. Manufacturing today is high tech. We use robots, we use automation, we use computer controlled machine tools, we use computer controlled processes. The people that are on the manufacturing floor are skilled workers and generally well educated, but even more important, educated for life. Every one of our employees here, but also in our customers, once they come in, they're continually trained for as long as they work at that company. I definitely see more, more training in the future. Currently, since graduation, I've been attending training through uh, that my that Aceta has put us through, um, and with this field, it seems to be an ever-growing field. So it's going to be continuous training. If you want to stay on top, as a person's career progresses, they generally get more and more skilled in certain aspects of that to the point where they start as a generalist and end up being an expert. And that comes with a lot of training and a lot of ongoing education because technology changes very rapidly and. Again, we, we believe in lifelong learning in our company. You know, manufacturing is the backbone that really built this country and certainly has built Wisconsin. Um, one in five jobs in the state of Wisconsin is in manufacturing. I think it's a pretty clear picture in the sense that technology will continue to evolve faster and faster. I think we also would agree that Wisconsin will continue to grow. So if we just use a simple growth rate of three and a half or four percent, another 300,000 jobs are going to be created in Wisconsin in the next decade. We don't have enough skilled workers today to fill that need. In the areas of CNC machining, welding, electricians, mechanical assembly, all those positions are really we hire out of the tech college system to, to, and it ensures the success of manufacturing in the future.